Hello everyone, I'm Joseph. Today I'll be reviewing the new drip line of Brew City called No Name Crafty Juice. That's how it came. Pretty uh pretty nifty packaging. Got the sticker and all the juice. So I'll be going through it looks like Blue Moon is like the ice cream. Toucan is like Fruit Loops flavor. SPF 15 is a pineapple cream and Sally is a key lime pie. So didn't ask for a nicotine, but I got them all in three, so that's perfect for me. That's my preference. Um, let's see, let's we'll start, start with SPF. This is SPF 15. Um, on the side, not exactly sure. It's got the the no name, um, kind of like a flavor reference, and the milligram. It looks like so. Yeah, it looks pretty good. I smelled them all already. They smell really, really distinct, really good. But they all kind of have the same same base smell but you can definitely smell the flavor that they're going for so I think they smell delicious so drip some of this SPF real quick This one is the pineapple cream. Really, really, really nailed the flavor with that one for sure. It's not too not too creamy. Like I don't really like the custards too much, but it's definitely like a really smooth pineapple cream. Like I think they nailed that one. Also, really good vapor production, by the way. Yeah, this is their drip line. So I mean, you can see it's definitely a lot higher. A lot thicker than their regular Bruce City, which is 50 50. I would say this looks around 80 20, maybe. Yeah, probably about 80 20, I would say. Which is uh, really good. Really good for good flavor and cloud production. So, uh, let's see. Next, I will be trying the toucan. And like, like I said before, kind of the same thing. No name. It's got the toucan and the milligram. So this one is the fruit loops flavor. Smells amazing. It smells like a just open a box of Fruit Loops. It's really fruity, but like the kind of cereal fruity. It smells awesome. So give this a go. Yeah, that smells awesome. Yep, 
Yeah, by the way, thank you, uh, PJ Allen and all the crew at Brew City. This was super generous to send me this new review. And I am highly impressed with it. It is amazing so far. So, all right, this is a two cam. Probably the best cereal juice I've ever tried. Normally, when you get like cereal crunch or whatever kind of cereal juice, you kind of get that nutty taste that I don't really like. Um, this doesn't have that. It's kind of like more cereal instead of that nutty, nutty undertones that you usually get. So this is pretty smooth. I like it. Once again, really good vapor production. I really like that one. That, that would definitely be a really good morning vape. That is for sure. By the way, New Year's is in three hours, so Happy New Year's, everyone. Next we have Blue Moon. I hear, haven't tried it, but I hear this is delicious. I see people on forums have this all the time, which is weird because I believe that the launch for this is early, early 2015, if I'm not mistaken. So... I don't know if they're getting samples, but I'm definitely happy because I finally get to try out the hype. So this one is the like the Blue Moon ice cream. So imagine kind of a creamy one as well. It smells kind of like a blueberry ice cream. Uh, like a creamy creamy blueberry so let's give this one a go So far all these are pretty sweet, but not overwhelmingly sweet. Just kind of, well, a little bit sweeter now, but it's, it's smooth. It's not like, I uh, get some juice and they had so much sweetener. It's like just unbearing, but it was, it was a pretty good medium. All right, so this one is Blue Moon. That one is incredible. I know right off the bat, I could vape this all day long. That is delicious. Tastes like, like a really high-end ice cream. Like, uh, what's that? What's that one ice cream? good it's called but it pretty much is right on point with the ice cream I'm thinking of. I can't recall it though. It's like the other's really good vapor production as well. 
I would have to say that this is definitely my personal favorite, in my opinion, out of these four. Definitely. That one is delicious. So smooth. Taste of berries, taste of cream. It's real consistent. It's not like certain afternoons, just a steady, smooth vape. Alright, so last but not least, we have the Aunt Sally, which is a key lime pie. Aunt Sally, same, same profile on the side. This one has a little I don't know if you can see it, but it's got a little slice of pie right there. Smells like fresh pie. Let's give this a go. Really creamy, creamy lime. Um, definitely, once again, hit the nail on the head. It tastes exactly like the profile. Really, really rich flavor. Like, definitely missing out on anything there. Um, Tastes of lime, kind of like a little bit of lemon, more citrusy. It's really smooth, creamy citrus, though. I definitely like it. Not really a big fan of the citrusy vapes. Like, I tried tried the Mountain Dew juice, didn't really like it. But it was actually really smooth. I, I definitely could vape this. So, yeah, once again, uh, give a shout out to Brew City. So was super generous to you guys. I mean, I've never had a company that actually like showed support to their customers. So yeah, this was definitely a treat from you guys. There it is again. And I believe they said they would be releasing this July. Uh, don't quote me, but I think. June or July of 2015, they said. Might be sooner, might be later, I don't know. But that's just what I heard. So, yeah. Thank you, guys. I will definitely be vaping this all night. That is for sure. That is my flavorite. So, yeah. I'm Joseph. Thank you.